All right, so what's going on, guys? This is my um, just kind of an unboxing video. I didn't want to bring them all out of the package and everything right now, um, or open the packages, I should say, right now. So, as you can see, um, I actually got two guide rods. I got the OEM one right here, then I got the uh, upgraded tungsten one right here, as you can see. So we're gonna be installing both of these. Um, I have been, I have already prepped my frame. Now, granted, this uh, trigger and stuff won't work. I do have my pins and stuff assembled already, but I know because uh, if you look at one of my past video or my videos that I'm gonna post probably before this, you'll see one of the mistakes I made making my P80 um, and I actually shaved this down. So I don't think this uh, will actually work if I put it in with uh, live components in it, but this slide doesn't have any um, you know, any trigger components or firing pin, nothing in that. So I'm just going to put it on and see how it fits and see if it goes straight on. So this is my first, um, assembly. And of course I got to do it off camera. So, um, I'm going to try the tungsten guide rod and I'll put the spring weights right here in the video. I'm just going to add them to the video. Cause I don't have no on my heart. I know this tungsten one is lighter. So, so, all right, so boom. It just went on no problem. So that's because I prepped my parts, polished them all and everything is going together. But as you can hear that, uh, I don't like that noise. Sounds like you're making a remix, Glock the remix. But anyways, other than that, seems to be fine. Um, functioning well, let's see if the trigger resets. And actually, I like this because you can see the back, see if it resets or not. So let's see, it does. So that's good. Um, I know that channel is probably, everything's polished up, but this is how it's coming along so far. I'm almost done. I do plan on um, adding a red dot. Um, just to give you a little sneak preview of what that'll look like. Boom, with the magazine in it. Let's see. So, not a not a bad looking package right there, but you know, we still got some ways to go. Still waiting on our upper parts kit. Um, still gotta test fire it and everything, and then um, still gotta get those screws for the red dot and you know, put in put on our sights. So we're almost done. I would say this is probably part two or three of four or five. So I'll let you know in the video um, what part this is. But we still got a lot of work to do to this. It's not uh, not nearly as polished as I want it to be. But let's, uh, let's see and show you where I was concerned about me having the most problems. Now, the easiest takedown for me, make sure it's unloaded. Right? Trigger all the way to the back. And then I can't actually do it in front of the camera. But basically just gonna pull the lever and then boom, and then it should come right off. Bang. So <clears throat> the part that I was worried about the most was let me get my pointer. This part right here. Because if you can see, kind of sorta. Um let me turn my flash off. <clears throat> 